Hey, what's up guys? So I've been asked a few times, how do I add music to my videos and boomerangs? And today we'll be covering that. But before I start, I do want to say that I hope you guys have been in good health and doing okay during this crazy quarantine time. So this tutorial is pretty simple. Once you guys know which 3D GIF or boomerang you guys want to use and which song you'll be using, the next thing you guys want to do is open up Premiere. Once Premiere opens, the next thing we're going to do is click New Project. And then name this whatever you'd like. And then you guys can save it to whichever folder you'd like as well. And then click OK. Now the next thing we're going to do is import our two pieces that we'll be using. So I'm going to go ahead and click and drag both of these onto the source. Alright, next thing we're going to do is click and drag this GIF onto the timeline. And now I'm going to select certain portions of the song that I want to use. And now I'm going to go ahead and then click this sound wave and then drag it onto the timeline. So now we have both layers. We have the 3D GIF or Boomer you guys are going to be using and then that music layer. So I'm just going to condense this so it meets that video length. And then the next thing we're going to do, because it's going to have a rough cut, like the song is going to end and then play again like really awkwardly if I copy and paste this. Because once Instagram loops it, it'll do this. Which doesn't sound good. So what we're going to do is on this music layer, we're going to hit Command Shift D and now we're going to fade out this song transition. So by holding, by clicking this and then dragging it to the left, we're fading out that song as you guys can see right now. So now you guys hear that it fades and we got to do the same thing to the beginning. So now when I copy and paste this, you guys can see it as an example how it looks when it's going to be looped. We can see if it fades out and plays really good or smooth. And yes, that sounds so much better. So if you guys would like, you guys can keep it like this where it's back to back or you guys can delete this. It doesn't matter because Instagram is going to loop it regardless. So the next thing we're going to do is go to sequence and then put render into out. So because it's yellow right now, it's not fully loaded. So once you render into out, it'll turn green, meaning it's ready to get exported at its highest quality. All right, now the next thing we're going to do is click File, Export, and then click Media. And then you guys just scroll down here and make sure that you guys have this checkbox checked out, the render at maximum depth, and this one too. And next thing you guys can do is just rename it if you guys want to by clicking this and just, yeah, typing in whatever you guys like. Click save, replace, because I made another one earlier, and then export. Popping Xanax, getting faded, medicated, sedated with my roommates and a couple friends rolling up blunts and blazing. Keep the green leaf lit, heavy drinking and about to lace this. The cocoa in my doja will get you higher than spaceship. This a night you won't remember. Take a shot and get drunk. Tell that breezy you've been watching to come through and smoke this blunt. And there you guys have it. You guys have now added music to your boomerang or GIF. I hope you guys found this tutorial super easy. This is quarantine tutorial one. <laughs> and if you guys have any questions, just let, let me know down below. I hope to catch you guys in the next one. All right, peace.